A delay today in Armwood High School's response to a state invest investigation that threatens its state football championship. Chief investigator reporter Alan Cohn joins us now, and he broke the story concerning illegal student transfers at Armwood. What's the latest here, Alan? That decision to uh, delay the response came at the very last uh, moment. As early as this morning, the school board told us that it intended to file its response today. On the last day, at the last possible moment, Armwood Principal Michael Lippolito asked for and received a one-week delay to respond to the investigation by the Florida High School Athletic Association. For instance, there's one question that says they needed information on all the students who were transferred into Armwood. We think that means all the students who were involved in athletics who transferred into Armwood, but we need some clarification. At stake is Armwood's 6A state football championship. It was an I-team investigation last fall which prompted the state probe after we uncovered the parents of senior Jack Lightsey failed to make a required full and complete move from their Orlando home and falsified documents claiming this small apartment near the school was the family's new residence. The ensuing state investigation confirmed what we reported and found Lightsey was ineligible to play for Armwood during its championship season. Sonny Hester is the former head of compliance for the FHSAA. It's exactly. Uh, with the evidence that you provided, there was, uh, and the rules that are in place, or were in place, uh, there was no other conclusion that could have been made. But the state investigation also found four other players falsified documents to enroll at the school. In one case, a utility bill was manufactured to claim residence. The lawyer representing some of the players implicated says they will appeal. Uh, they'll bring lawyers. They'll bring friends, they'll bring anything that they can, and they'll say anything that they can to get their kid through that committee. Despite this delay, sources say a deal is already in place for Armwood to forfeit its state, uh, title, and that is going to return to uh, mitigate other financial penalties that could take place. The school board says it will announce other moves that it will make when they announce their response next week. Reporting live at Tampa, Alicone, ABC Action News.